and I'm doing it for my daughter. Metal deposits are Emergency in that cabin. I'll shout out when I need you. Now, why can't I make her Chinese head pop like a grape? Can I zoom in? Does this have a scope? Alright, I'm just gonna get her in the pussy real quick. Uh, we got Matt T with the first 50 bones. Inflation hitting hard. Skip it, I don't wanna read that guy's fucking comment. Thank you, no, just kidding. You go ahead and read it. Uh, <laughs> uh, inflation hitting hard. Fifty dollar chat reads. This is Biden's America. Inflation's not hitting hard. All you need, my guy, is a little bit of punch, a little bit of kick. This will get you through your day. Trust me. That boring ass job that you got. I promise you, if you have three packs of these, it's gonna make your day a whole lot more entertaining. Oh yeah. What else is Matt T saying? Uh, looking forward to Fish Tank season two. What's this dumb bitch want me to do? I wasn't paying attention. Supervisor Lynn. Come on. With me. With her. I have to go with her? Where? What's my mission objective? Why doesn't it show me a big glob on the screen? Boop, boop, boop! Your mission objective! Boop, boop, boop! Run, run around! Here's the path! Here's the direct path to your mission objective! Boop, boop! <clears throat> I think that's a thing that's enabled by default. Yeah, there we go. Oh! Now, if that's not good game design... That'll really, when you're trying to get cozy, you're trying to get in the game world and really live in it and really experience storytelling, which is what it's all about. It's all about storytelling. Um, the fucking easy dots are gonna really. I think we'll be done here soon. What'd you say to me? Fuck. No, I hear this is the last dig. Couldn't even give him a name. Shut your mouth, you poor piece of trash. What's wrong with you? You're a poor piece of trash. Careful! That's why I'm killing you. Hey, watch it! What's wrong with you? Yeah, not much. Careful! Hey, Gosh. watch it! Oh, I'm gonna get it. Careful! Yeah. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Hey, I'm sorry, man. I didn't, Glad I didn't mean... this rock. Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean that, man. He seemed to have immediately forgotten. Well, he forgives me. He knows who I am. He recognized me. <laughs> From the TED Talk. <laughs> Hey, watch it! CBT. Hey, watch it! Shut up. I'm busy. All right, this is mining. This is my favorite. I love crafting games. I can't wait to see how much fun it is to mine in this game. Whoa! I got beryllium. Are you kidding me? Wow! Now I can make a beryllium milkshake. <laughs> this is awesome. Can I go from this distance? You got a few more dicks to go shut up. Get ready, boss. Yeah. Get back up here. Okay, that's immersive. I'm going back to my Come on. It's Chinese time. stepmother. You're with me. <clears throat> Watch your tootsies there, Chris. I got wheels rolling in. Oh, my stomach hurts from that sour. Ow. Bro, my tummy's. I got tummy pain right now. Not good. She's lemon. Oh. Uh, is it a, a boring machine? It's a boring, it's an Elon Let's boring go. machine, yeah. Keep moving. Ella, get the readings. Yeah, about that. Problem? It's off uh, the charts. Not if you consider a spike in gravity readings a problem. The gravitational warp reading is off the charts. You don't? We better She's get to our jump there. drive. It'll read as an anomaly. That's what I was told. Gravitational to anomaly? It must okay, be the artifact. Now you're starting to freak me out. Relax. It's just another job. Come on. It must be the artifact causing these gravitational anomalies. I'm going into the black hole and seeing if the jump drive works. We're getting close. I think. Yeah, everything is just. <laughs> Lynn, seriously. Uh, there's something really effed up about this. Where is it, Hella? Through there. I think. Okay, you, you're up. Something goes wrong in there. We'll come get you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> why would Let's anything go. go wrong? Would you shut up? Both of you do your jobs. Client is on his way. Hey, don't look at me. I've done my part. I like that. I like when she said, "You shut up." You shut up. They didn't try to conceal. I mean, one of the things about this game is the voice acting. Is they. They, I mean, it, it wasn't even a conscious, uh, it wasn't a conscious, you, man, you know what bothers me? When I notice 
things. People people think I'm being OCD and nitpicky, but then they wonder like why everything sucks. It wasn't a conscious decision to have Russian, Irish, Cockney accents in the voice acting Scouse. for this game. It's just something that happens when you have an uh, ensemble of voice actors is that they they put their own juice on it. The voice acting director, he, his ears are two pieces of shit attached to his head. Nothing registers with him. So the end result is you're in the year 2040, 2420 yeah. in outer space. You've got warp technology and you're talking to people and they're like, Hello, it's me. I'd like to be a bit of this. I've got to get to my spaceship in time. Otherwise, I'll be fired from my voice acting gig. Uh, we got, uh, Matt T with the 50 bucks. This is bullshit. I, I there should be way more thing. children in the Just Chinese mind. The kids can get to the hard-to-reach places. Yeah, man. I mean, that's the other thing. The other thing is, like... <clears throat> game, like, f oh my god. People who say games are art, they're absolutely not art. No. They're absolutely not. The, the, the cut-and-dry proof of that is, I've said this before, is, what's that game, um, Super Hot? The end of Super Hot, it's, which is a good, Super Hot's a good game, and the ending was like cool and trippy, is you, you point the gun in VR, like v, in VR, pointing a gun to your own head and killing yourself in VR is like crazy. That was like a, that was like a, a moment in the game where it could have been elevated to something higher than just the game, but they made them, but they made them take it out and they took it out and it's like no problem. There's no, like, oh. the artistic, like the most, Arguably the most like artistic part of the game where the authors the authors like um, it's it's an area where the author's uniqueness and individuality and their vision is like really like holding a gun to your head in VR and pulling the trigger is crazy. Yeah. That was a, that was like a when that when you do that, you're playing this whole game and then you do that and you're like, oh my god, wow, that was crazy. And they just take it out because you have to take it out because it's a game, it's not art. Um, so, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna just fucking play this piece of shit. Here we are with the gemstones. How many games, how, this is a question, how many games are there on Steam with the word void in the title? Uh, Have you noticed that? 25. Have you noticed that? <laughs> yeah. Void jumpers! Void surfing! Enter the void! The void! Black void! The reckoning! Yeah, that, that one in dust. <clears throat> Dust is another yeah. overused. Or, or dawn. Oh. Dawn of the Dust. This is trippy. This is crazy. This is like 2001 Space Odyssey. That way you're just mining and then you just trip out? Yeah, I, I, there was some dust Stop that um, had DMT and gave me a DMT awakening right here. Uh. Hey, come on. 